We can find a lot of interesting and useful things in our home, macaroni and semolina. Many people say that it's useful, but not for our waste, the dietitians assure. Today we will cook the flour products and semolina according to the special recipe. Hello, my name is Natasha Fochtina, and I'm glad to welcome you in our studio. Today, however, as well as always, we will make the interesting and original gifts. It's absolutely not necessary to spend a lot of money and strength to make their those. Simply, it's enough to look at home what interesting that we had no time to make over you still have. For example, the photo frames. Almost everyone has it at home. Photos are framed in the new and interesting, and the old are put on the entresol. I suggest to give them the second life and to make of them the remarkable home decoration. We take a small frame. I have forgotten that macaroni as a decorative element is necessary for us. We will decorate our frame with this macaroni. Don't forget that macaroni should be the original form, stars, letters. We will decorate with stars. To make such original gift, here such a remarkable frame, we need not much. It can be for 30 minutes, somewhere 24 hours we need that it will be dry up and will be possible to present it. So, we take the frame, preliminarily we have taken out the glass and the stand. As a result, we have such framework. We think on what scheme we want to make this frame, whether it's birthday, whether it's travel or simply pleasant surprise. Macaroni will help us in it. I have macaroni in the form of a ship, in the form of cars, in the form of planets, and in the form of stars. I like stars more, therefore we will make a star frame. It's pleasant to present to the friend such frame. So, we begin. If our frame is coated with any paint, it's necessary to use the emery paper. If you have simply wood, we put the filler on it. We emery our frame. The frame is ready to work. We take the filling on wood and we put it on our frame. The accurate thin layer is not the sandwich. We don't need a lot of filling. And we distribute on a small piece because the filling dries very quickly. We have already covered the piece and now we begin to glue our stars. We slightly press our macaroni by a finger. It's not necessary to press very strongly on them, as the filling is binding in sticky substance. And it's necessary that under our macaroni there will be a layer of filling. It looks very beautiful when our macaroni is a little bit leaves for frame ages. It adds to it a charm. By the way, for decoration on filling, approach absolutely various materials. The main thing is their texture. The glass beads mix up with large beads, see cockle shells and buttons, and also peas and a string bean, rice and buckwheat will be look very good. If to mix these textures, you will have very interesting products. I'm sure that nobody from your relatives never will guess from what all it has been made. The frame is almost ready, remains some macaroni. We have here such frame. Now it's necessary to dry it well. 
It's necessary to dry at room temperature, don't try to speed up this process, and don't put it to dry on the battery. It certainly will dry up faster, but the filling will crack and the frame will lose the remarkable look. Macaroni will fall. So, we put it to dry. By the way, if you don't have the filling, you can replace it with any universal glue. The color of cohesive mass is absolutely not important, as from above the product will be coated with paint and varnish. If you decide to be engaged in needlework with children, instead of cohesive mass, I suggest you to use plasticine. Only notice, as you don't coat the product from above, you need to choose the color of plasticine in the product very precisely. Our frame has dry up. If to examine it closely, you will see such interesting openwork surface. But that it begins sparkle from apart, that all contours of our macaroni will be visible, it should be coated with paint. In this case, we take a gold paint from can, and our frame will look like the metal. Necessarily, we take any box for not to soil nothing indoors. We put our frame and we coat it with paint. By the way, it's not necessary to cover with decorative elements all frame. It's enough one to make a surprise to your friend. The frame has dried up. It itself looks already well, but it's necessary to coat it with a clear varnish. First, the varnish will hold macaroni on the frame and it will be as a binding substance and will not give to our paint to peel off from it. In other words, you will use this frame much longer. So, we coat it with clear varnish. We take the varnish and using a brush we put it. By the way, thus it's possible to decorate not only the frames. You can use any subjects, caskets, glasses, vases. It will decorate your interior very much. I want to tell you that you can use not only the frames, but also any subjects which will seem to you interesting on the form. For example, here such glass jar decorated with the same stars and painted with a gold paint. Together with the frame it looks very interesting. As a result, we have the gift set. Also, it's possible to make a very beautiful a flower pot if to decorate with such original ornament pot top. We also put the filling and as the pot has a roof surface, it's not necessary to work up it. We take palette knife and the filling. We put only on pot edges, that products hold on it border. We put the filling also by small pieces, that it hasn't time to dry up. And we glue our macaroni. In this case, we take a theme of travel – steamships, plants, balloons and all it we put on our flower pot. As a result, we have such flower pot with such original macaroni border. We don't need any more the filling. We coat the flower pot also as well as the frame. It's enough to coat only the decorated surface. By the way, in such technique it's very good to decorate any subjects by the ropes and the tape. Somehow I have presented to my friend a pencil holder decorated with ordinary metal nails. It's his favorite pencil holder and now. By the way, it's about men's gifts. As a result, we have such flower pot. We put it to dry. And we will talk about the semolina. 
I think that very few people prefer to eat the semolina for breakfast, and very few people love it since the childhood. But nevertheless, we need it today. We will decorate a vase using the semolina. Here we have such interesting texture, vase made of semolina. I will explain now how to make it. We take a glass which becomes subsequently a vase, take the semolina and necessarily we pour it out on a flat surface. Now we take a brush, white glue, remove macaroni as they are not necessary to us anymore, and we coat with glue our glass. It's very convenient to insert a hand inside and to turn it. We coat with a thin layer. We have coated almost all glass, and now there is the most interesting. We lay aside the brush. And now we run over the semolina with the glass, so that the semolina stick around all our glass. By the way, there is one more method to decorate a vase. We will make such original collage, we will play on the different textures. On separate sides we put the glass beads or beads, and on others the semolina glued on white glue. This vase will necessarily take the place in your interior. The interesting texture already turns out. Here we have such thing. We put to dry for three hours, but we are the patient people and we want that it will be beautiful. It had been three hours. Our vase has dry up. It has a roof and velvety surface, but we don't stop on it. We need to paint it. For painting, we'll approach only gouache. Oil paints are too long dry, and gouache will be look very densely and good, and will underline the velvety structure of our vase. To begin with, uh, we draw the drawing, marked it with a pencil. We will not think out anything difficult, and we will try to simply divide into squares and sectors. It's absolutely not necessary to draw exactly, such roughness will add the interesting moments. Have made the vertical strips, now make the horizontal. We have divided our vase into such sectors. Now we take the paints and begin to paint. I suggest to take the solid color and to mix nothing, the vase itself will be enough decorative. The drawing from squares will be interesting. We continue on the diagonal one color. In other words, if we have one square at the top, we go down on the diagonal on one and it also will be red. Then you will see what happens from this. We will put the other colors likewise. 
I want to tell that even such vase also looks decoratively. But we continue our searches and we will add here some other colors. Here we have such original vase. We especially have sewed up nothing. We simply using simple and pure colors, have drawn here such squares and have put them on the diagonal. That it looks more interesting, it's possible to make such contours by a black paint. Then these colors will be a little divided. And the vase will look more interesting. By the way, if you are going to draw on difficult surface, such as glass or plastic, necessarily make it by gouache. If you have only a watercolor, find white gouache, and when you mix them, the colors will be pastel and it will be look very beautiful on product. So, I put the final stroke. Here we have such vase. When it will dry up, we will necessarily coat with a clear varnish and will present to somebody. I think that our friends and relatives will be happy with such gift. And where they will put this vase, it's their business. We put it to dry.
Today, we have worked with you wonderfully. We, from surpluses of products which are harmful to our waste, have made here such a remarkable macaroni photo frame, the macaroni flower pot and such vase of simolina. I ask you not to forget that in the house there are no unnecessary things. You simply haven't found the necessary application of them. And me, Natasha Fochtina, say goodbye to you, and I wish you health and creative success.